Hello everyone, my name is Venusian Calliope and welcome to the 14th video uploaded to my YouTube channel. So, it's actually the 14th video instead of like last week's fake 14th video. That was actually number 13. But yeah. So, I'm back to like my self portrait and okay, so you see like the skin tone there um that's actually from when I matched it to my knee. It's been kind of, like, tricky for, like, me to, like, match, like, things to, like, my skin tone. Because, like, just because, like, something is the same, like, skin t same, like, tone slash color as your knee doesn't necessarily mean it's the same color as your face. Like... Different parts of the body, like, have different colors, and it's okay. So, yay. Now that I've got that out of the way, um, it's been, like, really hard for, like, me to, like, mix, like, the right colors to get the right, like, shade of, like, my skin. So this is, like, me fixing that. And, oh my god, it took me forever to, like, mix, like, the white and the ochre yellow and scarlet and this like blue that starts with a ph is it like i don't know sometimes i like see a word and it's like i don't know how i should say that and it's like is it like pterodactyl blue yeah pterodactyl blue <laughs> but seriously though um I, like, mixed those colors until I, like, got something that sort of matched my concealer. So if you can find, like, a concealer that, like, matches, like, the skin on your face slash neck slash general area, then it's, like, a good starting place to, like, go and, like, especially if you need to, like, make more paint later. And it's just, like, it's just a good place to start. But, yeah, um... How have you guys been so far? Um, this week, this week has been really interesting for me. And yes, I own more than one shirt. <laughs> I just felt like wearing something a little bit different today. And, you know, I kind of like, like, the, like, chiffon satiny thing. Um... I just like the print of, like, the flowers and, you know, I just think it's nice, but, yeah. So, um, I have a lot of, like, time on my hands right now to, like, record and, like, talk about things, but, like, the last time I, like, tried to, like, record, like, audio for this, um, I ended up talking about Dracula for almost 30 minutes and I thought, that's a little much, even for me, because it's like, ah, Dracula. And I mean, it's probably my favorite, like, novel. If I had to, like, pick, like, a traditional, like, novel from the gothic, like, genre, I would pick Dracula. I mean, not to, like, diss Mary Shelley, because, like, we're not here for that, but, like, I actually liked Dracula more than I liked Frankenstein when I like read Frankenstein in 2013 was it 2013 yeah it was 2013 when I read it like near my birthday in 2013 and I remember being like kind of excited like when <sighs> Like, in 2013, I was going to turn 18, and, like, the same day as, like, Paul McCartney was releasing this album called New. Yeah. Paul McCartney was releasing a new album called New, and, like, and now that, like, New is, like, no longer as new, so it's, like, Paul McCartney's olderish album, New. <laughs> But yeah, um, I was, like, excited about it because, like, 
in high school, I had, like, a massive, like, Beatles fan stage, so it's like, yeah, I love the Beatles. I'm like, I actually have, like, the nickname, like, Ringo, because I used to, like, use, um, pencils and pens to just, like, drum out the rhythms of things, and I still don't play drums, but, like, I feel like if I started playing drums, I could get good at it, but, like, yeah, it's just, like, yeah, drums, and, like, if I get bored, I tend to, like, drum out, like, with, like, pens or whatever I have, and it's just, like, yeah, um, that's me using a Sharpie pen. Yeah, Sharpie makes pens now, um, if you didn't know that, um, I can get, like, kind of, like, obnoxious with, like, pens, where it's, like, Yeah, I don't know why, but, like, it just, like, calms me to, like, do that. And truth be told, I'm a little nervous right now because I have family coming over today, and I am a little bit, um, nervous about that. Maybe I'd be, like, less nervous if I had, like, two pens in my hand. Hang on. Yeah, I have two pens. But yeah, um. So does anybody like, you know, like, <laughs> frick. So you know how, like, when you watch, like, old movies from, like, the 1930s that are, like, set in, like, the 1800s or so? Um, how, like, the dresses sometimes look like they're more, like, um, fashionable to, like, the 1930s or 40s than they would, like, to the actual time period that the movie is set in. Because, like, I don't know why I like the aesthetic of that, but, like, I like the aesthetic of, like, those types of, like, dresses. Where it's like... Yeah. Where it's like, yeah, you're not actually 1860s, are you? You're more... 1936. But, I mean, it's okay. But seriously, though, um, yeah, I just really like the aesthetic of, like, dresses that are supposed to look older than what they are, even though they're, like, and they're still sort of, like, vintage-y, but, like, they're not, like, Victorian times vintage, if that makes sense. But, yeah. And, like, what I'm doing now with, like, the color, it's... Kind of, like, I'm color mapping, like, where the shadows are, like, supposed to go. So it's, like, it's more about, like, getting, like, a rough idea rather than, like, here is this or here's that. You know, it's, like, nothing has to be, like, perfect right now. Or, or even when we get to, like, the end of, like, my self-portrait, it's... Not gonna have to be perfect then, either. It's just about, like, capturing, like, a moment. And, like, life isn't perfect, and neither is art. And that is my brother. If you hear him in the background, um, yeah, that's him. Um, I'm mostly home alone right now, but, like, I have, like, my brother and my youngest sibling here, so... Yay, I'm recording! But yeah. Um, that was like a pen. But yeah, um, frick. Okay, let's focus on to something. So like, you know how like, Dracula from like, 1931? You know, like the one with Bela Lugosi? Yeah, you know. You know that one. I mean, everybody, like, who knows about Dracula knows about, like, that one, right? But, yeah, um, there's a Spanish version of that, and I honestly kind of like the Spanish version a little bit more, 
Just because, like, there's more costumes and there's more... Like, there's, like, more, um, depth to, like, the delivery of, like, the lines. And I know that, like, some parts of, like, 1931 Dracula has, like, aged, like, milk. Like, the treatment of, like, mental illness and stuff like that. And I mean... <laughs> but we have to, like, remember that, like... That sometimes, like, things from the past are going to age terribly. That's just how progress is made. But, I mean, that still doesn't make it less wrong. So, yeah. But, yeah, um... In the novel, um, Dracula, we don't really hear much about, like, Lucy Westenra's, like, perspective. We get, like, two journal entries and, like, the letters that she writes to, like, Mina. And that's, like, it. Like, we don't actually, like, hear from, like, her perspective that much. But we do know, like, some things from, like, the text. Like, how, like, Lucy's mother is, like, kind of controlling and the fact that she also removed the flowers from her room. Like, there were, like, these, like, garlands of, like, garlic flowers. And, like, who removes, like, garlic flowers when, from a room, when somebody's, like, being, like, overly protective of you? Like, you're not supposed to touch them. You're not supposed to touch them. You're not supposed to touch them. But, yeah. I mean... I don't know. I just get, like, the vibes that, like, Lucy's mom is, like, kind of controlling and just, like, a little bit too high-strung for her own good. She kind of reminds me of, like, a couple of, like, family members that I know at the top of my head. I'm not going to name names, but if you've been watching the channel, you probably have, like, kind of an idea of who it may be. But, like... <sighs> But yeah, and then, like, and after, like, okay, so, like, Lucy basically just, she p dies, okay, she dies. I'm gonna be honest and just, like, say it bluntly, but, like, yeah, I mean, she was, like, 19 when, like, the novel started, and then she just dies from, well, basically being attacked by, like, a vampire, like, multiple times. And she ends up becoming a vampire, and that's when her three suitors and Dr. Van Helsing have to, like, kill her again, and... And, like, when she's, like, in, like, the catacombs of, like, you know, the novel, she basically acts out of character from what we've known, like, her previously. But sometimes I feel like... I feel like sometimes, like, sometimes characters are coded to, like, have trauma. And I feel like Lucy is kind of an example, if that makes sense. But, like, yeah. Lucy has trauma. And I feel like a lot of, like, her lashing out at the end might be from, like, feeling like a lot of, like, the people around her that should have protected her failed. If that makes sense. But yeah, um, anyway, I kind of, like, relate to, like, Lucy in that regard. But I mean, I understand. But I'm, like, in a different place now. But anyway, um, let's talk to, like, 
let's talk about like something like a bit more lighthearted. Like I don't know. Um. Hmm. Well, I mean, I could say like flower crowns, but like I'm like looking at like this like massive like red and white rose flower crown that I have that has like these like fake strawberries in. And like a friend made it for me. And honestly, I'm like really glad that I still have it. But yeah, flower crowns. Also, the shirt that I, like, am wearing in the video, um, I've had that for, like, two years, I think. So, yay! Two years of, like, having, like, that same shirt that I've, like, worn for, like, um, Halloweens and stuff. I don't know why, but, like, my default costume for, like, Halloween is almost always, like, vampire attack victim. Because it's, like, easy to, like, do, like, the, like, little dots on the neck and just be like, Oh, fake blood dripping down my neck. It's okay. Ugh. Or, like, zombie makeup. Zombie makeup is, like, really easy for me to, like, do. And sometimes I do it. Um, in high school, um, we didn't really have, like, a traditional, like, PE class. But we had, like dance classes so I took a dance class and like we learned how to do like thriller and like a couple of like traditional like Spain Spanish dances like the Sevillanas <laughs> but yeah um I can do thriller I did thriller like for like two years in a row so yay thriller but yeah where it's like Oh, God, if I, like, do that, um, frick, I'm gonna get copyrighted, so, um, you know what Thriller sounds like. If you know what it sounds like, you know what it sounds like, and I'm not gonna, like, really repeat it. But you know the dance. And the routine. And I'm really proud of myself for, like, how, like, the dress, like, turned out here. But, yeah. Mostly because it's kind of, like, hard to, like, shade for shades of, like, white. So I had to, like, mix white with, like, some purple, a little bit of gray, and some blue. And, yeah. So, that's what I, like, did, and I just, like, sort of, like, followed, like, my instinct when it came to that. But, yeah, um, I'm kind of, like, excited. I'm kind of, like, nervous right now. And, I mean, I'm running a little ahead when it comes to, like, recording, like, audio for, like, video, for videos, like, I'm actually recording the audio on, like, Monday the 16th of January 2023, so, yay! And I mean, and I'm also, like, going back to, like, um, como se dice, como se dice, like, Instagram, and I've been, like, posting every day now, um, my Instagram handle is Venusian Calliope, which is the same as my YouTube handle. So, yay! But yeah, um... I'm a little, like, sleepy. But I also have, like, allergy shots tomorrow, so... If I sound a little congested, that's why. So I'm like, yay! But also not yay at the same time. And I mean... I don't know. Sometimes I feel like I'm running on empty, even though I know that I shouldn't be, if that makes sense. So it's like, ugh. But yeah, um, today has been, like, interesting for me because, like, I've had to, like, help with, like, my friends and my mom with, like, this thing. So it's like, yay. I've just been, like, it's 
then like everybody like wants me to like help them with something and I get it it's kind of like hard and I understand but yeah I can't really breathe through my nose right now but like I'm fine I promise I'm okay but yeah So now I'm, like, kind of, like, color mapping, like, the hair slash where it should be, if that makes sense. But, yeah. Uh, mind if I yawn? I'm just gonna, like, yawn right now. Um, so when it comes to, like, sketching things out, um, I don't know why, but I, like, this, like, Sharpie pen that I got. I'm not sponsored, by the way, I just like them. I'm just like, yeah, this is a good quality pen. And it can, like, do, like, the clicky thing that I did earlier. I'm going to do it again. Good quality clicking. <laughs> but, yeah, frick. I don't know if, like, the frame rate is going to look as bad as, like, it does on, like, GarageBand right now. But, like, oh, my God, the f frame rate... <laughs> It's so bad, like, on GarageBand. I'm just like, I hope it doesn't look as bad as it does, like, for me. But yeah, it's like moving, like, one frame per second on GarageBand, and I'm like, oh my god, how am I going to explain this if it's, like, this bad? That's like, I mean, it's okay, but it's like, oh my god, I'm literally so sleepy and tired and, like, I'm going to, like, go take, like, a rest slash nap slash what have you, like, as soon as, like, my family's, like, gone. <sighs> Would any of you notice if I, like, fall asleep while, while recording audio in GarageBand? I mean, I think y'all would, but, yeah. So, like, to get, like, that, like, brown shade um I mix like the same colors that I use to like get like my skin tone but I put a bit more scarlet in there and I didn't mix that much white into it so now it just like looks like this like mahogany brown and I know in theory I could have used a little bit of black in there because like it's my hair is kind of naturally really dark, but, like, I chose not to. I don't know why yet, but, like, it'll make sense later. So, yay. I'm kind of excited, but I'm kind of nervous. About, like, how, like, the end product is going to, like, turn out. I mean, I already know what it looks like right now because like I've already added like the arms and I've like remixed like the skin tone paint color and I decided to like make more of it and like it's like in like a safe little like space where it won't like dry out right now and I've had to like look up YouTube videos on like how to prevent like acrylic paint from drying too fast and how to like store it properly so yay I'm making progress and it helps to, like, have, like, bags and, like, put it with, like, a lid thing. Um, dude, please don't use my channel as, like, a guide for that. Um, but yeah, I got, like, a jar with, like, a lid. Uh, well, I say a jar with, like, a lid, but I mean, it's, like, an old thing of, like, moisturizer that I had. And I just, like, mixed, like, paint until, like like, the same colors of, like, paint until I got, like, the shade that I needed, so. Yay, and I also, like, added arms already. Well, I say arms, but, like, parts of arms and, like, a pomegranate. Well, the start of a pomegranate, so y'all are gonna be, like, seeing that, like, next week, so. Yay! Pomegranate! Pomegranate time! Well, not quite pomegranate time right now, but, like, it'll be pomegranate time next week. But, yeah. 
I'm also, like, really, like, a fan of, like, the choker and my Larimar pendant, like, necklace. It, it's, like, a good combo. Like, yeah. Sleepy. Okay. So, like, yeah. Also, um, when it comes to, like, skin tones, um, when it, when you're making, like, the eyes, um, don't, like, use, like, just pure white for, like, the whites of the eyes. You need to, like, mix, like, the skin tone with, like, some gray and, like, a little bit of the white the white to like get like the whites of the eyes like properly and even then you can like do whatever like you feel like it if that makes sense god I don't know what I'm gonna do for like the eye color when I get there but like when I get there y'all will know so yay hey can I like show like a picture of you know what no let's save that for next week y'all need to like keep coming back or something yeah. Woo. A little bit sleepy, but, like, I don't know. I'm, like, excited. Honestly, as soon as, like, my grandparents are, like, out of town, I'm going to get myself some boba and maybe, like, run or something. And, like, and, like, go to the gym like I normally do. So, yay. We're getting, like, I'm starting to, like, find my new sense of, like, normal, and I'm okay with that. And I'm just glad that I'm, like, able to, like, do this and, like, be here for y'all and be here for me. And I'm just, like, I don't know, excited, sleepy. And also, like, I'm proud that, like, I found my old palette for this, so... Yay! That's fun. That is fun. Ugh. Sorry for yawning, but I mean, I, you know what? I'm not gonna apologize for yawning. It's my video, and I get to yawn if I want to. Anyway, here's the painting. <laughs> 